Live. Hey everyone, Ooh. Hassan here. Welcome to the Yay, world of Ha. All the people. I am here with Maheen. Yeah. And today it's very special live stream because. Well, first I'll wait for people to join <laughs> to make sure we're even talking to anyone. There we go, Wolf and Regina. Cool. What's up, Tomas, Jared? Alex, David, what's up, Why are up, you everyone? saying it like that? Because it's cool, man. No, it's not. It's like, otherwise just like Alex, David. I'm like, yo, Carlos. Carlos like, I'm, gotta give, I like that name. Like, enthusiasm. Their games, too. The, the mask wrestler. wrestler. Are you one of those, uh, Brandis. what's it, Lucha Lee with Lucha? Lucha oh, the yeah, Lucha Doors or whatever? Lucha Doors, yeah. Edward is the oh. man. What's up? Joe Cupid Ranger, happy Friday. Wait, yes, it is Friday. <laughs> I didn't think for a second. Um, okay, so here's the deal, guys. We are doing a Nintendo Labo Woo! unboxing and some builds. So this is the variety kit. Um, so it has all the things that you see on it right here. RC car, there's two of them. Mm -hmm. That's what we're going to be doing today. It has a piano. It's got the fishing rod, the house, and the motorcycle handle thingy. Yeah. And the back of the box shows all the things that you can do. Yep. So you it can... also comes with extra pieces. Yes, extra pieces included. Make, play, and discover. Yep. Um, so that is the variety kit. There's lots of stuff in here. Really, really cool. Um, and Nintendo literally just... I got an email from Nintendo about Nintendo Labo right now, uh, which is funny. Uh, I'm going to do... So here's the deal. Today we're doing the RC car. But I'm going to be doing all of the Nintendo Labo stuff live over the course of the next few days and weeks. Um, so today is just the RC car, but all of Nintendo Labo I'll be doing in live streams, including, so today we also have this, Nintendo Labo customization set. So this has got basically a bunch of like stickers and... Stencils it looks like. Oh yeah, yeah, some stencils and stuff <clears throat> too. Uh, yeah, so a bunch of stuff. We'll open it up and see. So this is uh, an extra add-on. We're gonna decorate our RC cars basically. In the future, not today, so we're not going to be opening this today, but in the future, I have the robot kit also. Don Arigato. This is more advanced. <laughs> so, it's too hard. Too hard yeah. for me. Yep, I can do it. <laughs> I might try. So, we're going to do the unboxing of right, Nintendo Labo. So. Oh. Well, I should probably get my Switch, too, because we're going to need that. Yeah. Okay. So, open it up. You've got a <clears throat> get oh, get started little cardboard thing, and then you've got your little instruction booklet, and then the Nintendo Labo game. Yeah, so there's the, the game. game in there. Okay. So, it's kind of a plain looking box for the game. Yeah, I thought it was the instruction manual, but it's just the game. It looks more like it would be like a instruction video yeah. rather than but, well know. i guess technically that's well anyway, it is we more can than just get into that later so and then there's like a thing remove the game card insert game card into nintendo switch console and start the game and then select make and start building okay oh, okay so we'll follow along on the instructions on here Ooh. and continue you want me to should i open this yeah got it do any of you guys have labo did you guys pick it up I know everybody's always joking, like, why are you paying all this money for cardboard? It's You guys don't understand what it is. It's not cardboard that you're paying money for. Um, you can buy the cardboard on Nintendo's website for, like, a few dollars or so. Like, it's pretty cheap. What what you're getting is the, the software, and there's something called ToyCon Garage where you can create your own custom stuff. It's really, yeah, yeah. like, intense, actually. There it is. Um, <laughs> so here's what it looks like up close. There it is. So there's the design. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to put it into... That's also true. And you also have also... Um, if you do buy the cardboard on your own, you also do all the measurements and all that on your own. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure some people are going to do that. And I'm sure we'll see some creative things. But I mean, I'm fine. I already saw a video it. of somebody making their own guitar. So yeah, here's, you know, the kit with like the strings and some silver stickers and rubber bands and some rings, you know, things that are going to go into your 
thing later. And of course, you know, you also need all these things. And you're gonna build your thing. So here is, I guess that's just storage. But it's anyway, hard to tell which cardboard yeah. is the actual cardboard we need. That's the most important piece. So here's our first piece. This is for oh, the okay. house. Yeah, so this is the, are they like labeled in any way? Uh, it says A. Oh, maybe all the A is for the house or for no. one item. I don't uh -uh, know. Because this not. is the RC car, isn't it? Okay, maybe Is not. it? Is this the yeah, RC yeah, I think car? That, yeah. you're right. And this also says A. Oh, so is the but house? But it has a little symbol on the side. for the house? Is this it? Oh. All right, maybe there's more. Maybe there's there's like more. a lot of sheets. So then here's a fishing rod. You can also tell by the colors. So there's that yeah, one, the house. Is. RC car. Okay, here is a fishing rod. Fishing rod has A, B, C. Wait, what? Wait, oh, C and D. And then... E. Oh, this is the F. F. Okay. Okay, so there's F. So six of them. No. No. Oh, okay. This is the rod. house. Oh, okay. So I don't know what the other one that is. That looked then. like a roof. That's why I thought it was the house. But here's the house. Um, you can see it in the corner. What's the corner picture? It's a light bulb. Oh, maybe this is like extra pieces to maybe. customize stuff. Yeah. Oh, because you can make their house uh -huh. roof, shingle roof and then color it in. Okay. Yeah. So That'll see. be pretty cool. I think so I would enjoy coloring it in and stuff. So here's house part A, part B for the house, part C There's for the house. There's a lot of cardboard in here. <laughs> D for the house. And then here is the motorcycle pieces. So. Let me move the RC car one out of the way so we know this. B. Oops. C. Now, be careful with these because the pieces come out pretty easily, which is a good thing, but then also, like, yeah. Uh, D. E. And F. G. L. H. H. Okay. And then here's the piano, so, which is. Very complex. Just take them, let's just take them okay. all out at once because then we know, because I think that's the last one. So the piano goes to H. So, and um, that is everything. Yeah. So you see that it has the label right here is what she okay. was talking about in the corner for what it is, basically. So that's that. And now let's take a look at this. The um, customized kit, the customized set. Oh, okay. Oh, before I do that, let's open it up. I don't want to rip the packaging. Hmm. Yeah. So do any of you guys have, I think, did you already ask if they, any of them had Labos? Um, a couple of people said no. I don't know if anybody said yes. Somebody asked what is Labo. So basically um, what it is is these like cardboard creations that you can create and you put your Nintendo Switch like in it or with it and it turns it into like an accessory. So you think of like accessories, like you remember back in the Wii days they had like the the baseball bat accessory for your Wii remote and all that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. Except now it's made out of cardboard, which sounds kind of lame, but at the same time, it can be creative because you can design it how you want. Um, and there's some, there's in the software itself, you can actually make your own um, types of games with it too. Mm -hmm. So uh, you'll see once we once we start creating some of these advanced And I really things. like how Nintendo is sort of implementing that because it's like maybe if your kids or there's kids or you're more tend to stick with video games and stuff. This can get you, you know, using your hands, being creative, building things, getting your creative juices flowing. Yeah, it's it's very um it's uh it's you know like DIY stuff. Like you I know, like kids it. love playing with like Legos and building things. This is kinda like that. You get to be creative. So there's things first. So there's a cardboard piece, not much in there, but there's some sheets of stickers in a packet. Um, but we'll go over more of that later. But it looks like eyes and stuff. But we'll go check those out more in depth later. Ooh, a, oh, some tape probably. Some tape. Some tape of primary colors: red, yellow, and blue. So that's pretty cool. What is that tape? That's called washi tape or something, or something. And then it looks like there's a second row. I think it's also tape, and that's thicker. And it says Nintendo Labo. Interesting. So to build stuff, That's this it. customization set is obviously not required. Mm -hmm. um, and honestly, it's like probably overpriced for what it is. Yeah. But um, I figured I'd do it for you guys to see in the video in this review. Okay. And then. Um, so yeah, you've got some stickers, 
of eyes. You know, you can see Bowser and Goomba, Mario, Toon Link. Oh, uh, yeah, um, that's right. Oh my god. Splatoon, Splatoon stuff? Yeah. yeah, Bowser. Oh, that's awesome. Some of the characters. Looks like, um, Yoshi, not Yoshi, Toad Eyes. So that's pretty cool. I like those. I think, I don't know, I might do Toon Link or Peach Eyes. Those are cute. Oh, sorry, K.K. Slider. Yeah. Are they? Where are his? Right there. Oh, cool. Yeah, so those are pretty cool. There are the stencils. Pretty pretty flimsy, but they are like plastic, so you know, they won't they won't tear. You probably still have to be careful with them, but they won't rip. So you know, letters A through Z, a heart, a star, so, and then the numbers, and then these two things on the bottom, and then the Nintendo logo. Nice. Cool. Then your second sheet of stickers is just Oh, like different Nintendo more Labo so, stuff. Yeah, more so Nintendo Labo themed things. Got a little Switch too. That's cool. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, the, so those are really, really cute. Yeah, I like those. Nice. I think it'd be fun to get creative with those. And then there's little things that we can like label our RC cars with our names. That would be cool. Oh, nice. So let's start up the software and then we're going to get into doing the RC car. So here's what it looks like on the screen. It's a little hard to see. Uh, yeah, it's a little hard to see, but it's um, basically like the colors of Nintendo Labo and it's got all the icons of the different things. So I'm gonna, oh, there's a system update. So let's do this update real quick. And then uh, update complete. All right, so console's restarting. But basically we're gonna do the RC car and I think this is it for the RC car. Um, this is the only one sheet of cardboard um, that we need to build the RC car. So we're, we're going to go through all the steps. It'll tell us which ones to punch out when as we go through all the steps. Nice. So. All right. So I'm booting up Nintendo Labo on here. I kind of wish they sold the software digitally and just the cardboard on its own because I like having it digital, but oh well. So it says Nintendo Labo. So this is the variety kit, basically. Oh, bye, Sophie. Bye, Sophie. Let's start with make. Okay. All right, so I click on make. First, First. we'll practice, basically, okay. is what it says. So here's what the screen looks like. It's, like, yellow. It's hard to show. Welcome to Nintendo Labo. Well, let's start with... All right, so basically, you have to hold the forward button to make the video play. Release the button to pause. Make a Joy-Con holder. Oh, maybe that's what that extra thing is. Oh, I think so. Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, it is. okay. That makes sense. Okay. So but there's it... also the extra pieces. Like, it's your little man person yeah, and yeah, then an extra right. roof, all those things. <coughs> Sorry, okay. I think I'm coming down with a bit of a cold. No, you're not allowed to be sick. I'll be sick for a while. There's a light bulb right there. So this is the light, extra piece. Light bulb. Groot. <laughs> Wait, this is right the... here. This is the box. Okay. It's right near the roof. All right, so this one needs to be popped. Careful. Do you want to pop it up? Well, careful, there we're... careful, 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 careful. Be careful not to bend anything. Oh, fuck. God, pressure's on, isn't it? Okay. All right, hold forward to make the video play. All right, so it's playing. All right, and we'll use the other pieces later. In the meantime, keep it stored safely away. Okay. So this is kind of cool because basically you can have this forward and back button and it tells you what to do. So I'm not going to show you the screen because it's hard, but you can follow along with what we're doing basically. Um, I think we can punch out the little holes. Um, yeah, that one there. And then there's one other one in the middle, I think. Oh, we can rotate it around. That's cool. So you can rotate it around with your finger to see like all the stuff and you can zoom in and out. So that's pretty cool. Move the, oh, okay. So you can move it that way too. You can reset the camera that way. Okay. So take a good look at the screen to make sure it matches what we're building. Yep. All right. Matches. All right, so start with the over. printed side facing okay. down. Okay. Got to face down. So the key is to crease firmly along the fold lines. Be sure to crease them nice and firmly. That will make it easy to build. If the folded piece stand it up, stands up on its own, that's a good sign. There we go. Standing okay. on its 
So then we're going to fold that other crease. Okay. All right. Okay, and then the, there's another crease right there. Yep. And then the next one, right up here. This one. Oh. Okay, I'll be careful. Okay. Okay, see how much easier it is to crease all the fold lines at the beginning, okay? So then, okay. so then it's showing us the tabs. Mm -hmm. This one here. It is really creative, Sophie, yeah. The tab is going to be inserted into the go. opening. Right Make sure it doesn't get bent. All right, yep. perfect. Okay. And then mm -hmm. that part is going to get folded. And then, the and then the other tab goes in as well. Mm -hmm. Good. Okay, so I see how it is. I'm just floundering a bit. Mm -hmm. There we go. And there it is. Okay, so that is the Joy-Con holder, basically. Yep. Joy-Con holster. Mm -hmm. So we need the right Joy-Con ready. Mm -hmm. All right, mm -hmm. and basically you just put it right in. in, all the way until, yeah, until it's in there. Oh, yep. okay. And there's... So that's a little holder. Mm -hmm. Cool. Can you see the button through the hole in the back? So it's kind of like walking you through it step by step, which is really cool. What's up, Jakester? All right, so we're gonna hold down done. That's it for practice. Mm -hmm. All right, on to the real thing. Three, two, one. Now it's like taking off like a rocket. <laughs> nope. All right. Let's put that down. <clears throat> okay. And then there's like a little menu of options, and then you just pick what you want from there. Yeah, and it's cool because it gives you estimated completion of times as well. So, for example, the RC car that we're going to do is 10 minutes, so you can kind of... Yeah. See right there. It looks so like a panel the, the longest with Yeah, the one form. 150 to 210 minutes. Yeah. So that's a long one. So yeah, make sure you got the time to do that. RC car. Sickness. There was someone who just made a really long comment. I don't think we saw it. Sorry. Okay. Sure. Okay. So you want to get the RC sheet? Yes. So right here is the RC sheet. What time is it right now? It is 7 30. 8 30. Ha, 8 30. All right. Okay. Here we go. There are two steps to complete. All right, so yeah. step one, making the RC car and the antenna. Take out, all right, so those two parts, basically. So, so it basically highlights the, the parts that we need. So by the way, guys, if you have anything in the chat that you want to say, go for it. We, we may or may not see it. We might miss it, but we'll try and yeah. read what we what we can as well. Bye, um, Wolf and Reigns. Bye. So we have one piece right here. Uh, okay. And then it wants us to take out this piece, mm -hmm. the antenna. So here's the antenna. Mm -hmm. Okay. There's an elephant head also. The other pieces will come in handy later. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, so, oh, the, we need to punch out some of the little tabs in here as well, mm -hmm. it says. So, we'll punch out these tabs. Now, we're on the East Coast. We are in Virginia. Mm -hmm. We're on the East Coast. Okay. 
Okay, so punching out these little tabs. I think that's it for what we need to punch out. Okay, so start with printed side face down. The, um, I would just grab, this because the other one's there too, right? Is there another antenna or no? There's only one antenna, but I don't know that we need two antennas. Do you want to just take out the other sure. punch out? Because it's going to be the same instructions. Yeah. So you might as well take out the other one. Okay. Um, so the only thing is that's confusing because there's no printed design on yeah, that. Yeah, they don't color this one, but that's okay because then that just means you can get really, really creative with it. I already know I want to add the elephant head to mine. Okay, so I'll wait for it to get it out so we can go through it together. So this one has the printed side on it, and the instructions are only walking us through one, but it does come with enough pieces for two basically. So. Um, yeah, those side tabs go out. And then these two little tabs there. <laughs> Have I ever been to Kentucky? Uh, I don't know. I don't think so. All right, cool. Um, so let's forward on here and let's see what's next all right so now we need to fold oh like all the way to here so this first oh, okay. line basically all right so I'm gonna fold it all the way and fold it back and then we fold it and then back. this part yeah without leaving the antenna piece okay Wow. <laughs> you can probably build it quicker than we are too we're just trying to like tell you guys what we're doing yeah. as well so um all right then the side pieces then fold in and then the other side yeah okay um okay so then these little tabs these top parts here what is it Oh, that little piece. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, and then the other little tab folds in. So a lot of folding that you're going to be doing, which will make it yeah. easier um, once we continue. Then, then on the other side, same thing. Okay. So let me fold this. Then fold this. Uh, then the side tabs. Okay. Makes you wonder how complex some of the stuff really can get if it's supposed to take you three, four hours to build. Like, yeah. it's pretty crazy. Okay. Uh, and then these little tabs on the inside. So lots of folding going on. Mm -hmm. Okay. Kind of reminds me of origami in that, like, you have to make, like, a lot of folds and creases first before you actually make the final thing. That's true. You can build it docked if you want. Let's go back and forth with the buttons. Cool, Alex. Thank mm -hmm. you. I am 26. Plus one is 28. Okay. Oh, so these, are they staying up now? It looks yeah. like maybe? Okay. All right, so then we're gonna basically bring in the sides of the, the thing in like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, now it's coming to these two. Okay, so. Okay, these two are gonna be like, that. Yes, so the tabs have to line up okay. just like that, exactly. Mm -hmm. Okay, so once they're all lined up, then, ah, okay. okay. So then you're going to bring in this piece. You have to make sure the tabs are on the outside so it'll fold in. Okay, just like that, and then these tabs are going to fold in like so. Just like that. Yay. I always thought of these things as like little bugs when I first saw it because I thought these were little legs yeah, and stuff. Right. I was like, a RC car? I thought you're making like a remote control bug or something. Yeah, that does All not right. look like an <clears throat> RC car. 
And that's pointing to this side again. Is it all the way in? Yes. Oops. Okay, so now okay. it's showing. I gotta fix something. Let me go fix it. Oh, that piece has to go in, yeah. Uh, okay. There we go. Alright. <clears throat> Alright. So, okay, so both tabs are in. Yeah. Flip it over. Make sure none of the six legs got bent. That's oh, done. That's it. So that's it, guys. Yeah. This is it. <laughs> Yay! Move on to the antenna. So there's one antenna, I think, because that goes on the switch, basically. So right here, so there's only one because it goes okay. on the switch. Um, printed side face down. Once you're done folding the tabs, okay, so fold the left and right tabs. <clears throat> that's oh, it. That's the it. antenna's <laughs> done. All right, there we go. Easiest build ever. All right, so now step two is attaching everything together. So let me take off the other Joy-Con. So basically, oh, interesting. So the tabs slide into oh, where the Joy-Cons cool. go. I really uh, want to know who came up with this at, like, you know, yeah. Nintendo and, like, thought, like, hey, why don't we do all this? And then just, like came up with all these little details Oops. and all these things. Uh oh. What did I do? Oh. oh no. I accidentally hit the X. Will it take us yeah. back to where we were? Yeah, it does. Okay, cool. That's actually nice. Um, so it just kind of slides in. Oh, that's so neat. So it literally just slides into the sides, just like that. Mm -hmm. So the switch has got a little antenna. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Did you, you answer both? both of them? <laughs> yes. <Making. laughs> Yay, antenna's attached. Let's attach the Joy-Con controllers, okay? Also, by the way, I was wondering if it would do this, and I'm happy that it does. The The colors of the Joy-Con that it show there match your actual Joy-Con. Because a lot of the videos online have shown the red and blue Joy-Con, so I was like, I want to try my green and pink to see if it shows green and pink. And it shows green and pink, which is great, because that way you know which color matches up with which. So I love that. I love that it shows you the actual color. All right. So left Joy-Con is going to the RC car. We'll probably have to get another left Joy-Con for you, I'm assuming. Um, so we'll grab that in a second. Make sure the, oh, okay. So you see there's a plus minus. So the minus symbol has to match with the minus. And basically you just kind of slide it in. You flip it over and it's supposed to slide in like that. Whoa. Hmm. I just want to check out what I can do with the elephant head because I think it'll be cute to have this on there. I was kind of hoping hoping we don't have to put it at the eye so I could, so could add on these stickers, but looks like they do, but that's okay. Okay, let me just make sure it's all the way in. Yeah, so it should be all the way in. Okay, now we have to attach the right Joy-Con on the other side. Okay. Slide it out of the little holder. So basically... There we go. The only thing is... It's supposed to be... A little loose on the front, maybe? Doesn't really say. Looks like it is, though. It should be, right? Yeah, because it's, it's, it's skinnier in the bottom. This yeah, okay. Oh. You're interested in learning more about us. Do you have any questions? You can go ahead and ask them for whatever you want to know. All right. Okay, do they feel a bit loose? Not to worry. Perfect. That's the key to making the RC car move. That makes sense. Oh, okay. And I'm glad that they addressed that. Yeah. See, they, they really, like, think everything through. Like, all the questions people are going to have. Yeah. Sweet. Okay, so we're going to try this out, and then we're going to do the... I'm, I'm sure after this, it'll ask for the two-player mode or whatever. So then we can, um... Let me see if I can put this on here. Play now. Okay. Let's see. Oops. That is a... 
So here, here it is, by the way, guys. This is supposed to be our RC car. Thank you. Houston, what's your favorite <laughs> Nintendo console? Um, well, Dallas, uh, it is Nintendo Switch. The quality. <laughs> oh, okay. I think it's ready. So let's see if I can flip the uh, this here. So there's the Switch. And basically, let's see how this works. I wonder if... The... That sounds like a phone. Oh. So it's moving a little bit. That's side. I think it's the the table. Yeah. It's not um Can we put it on the box maybe? Or do we have the other well, Yeah, let's try. Let's see. Let me try putting it here and seeing on the box if it'll move more easily. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. So you need a pretty smooth surface though. Yeah. Oh, well, that's kind of cool. That's a lie. So this is the front of it, I guess. Is Maheen going to Pentacon? Uh, you spelled her name right, um, and no. Um, she's not going to, to Pentacon. <laughs> what does this button do? Oh, okay, that got fancy. So this button opens up, and you can see the infrared sensor. You can see my hand. Um, cause there's a mode where, oh, auto. Yeah, yeah. So that's, how do you do the antenna? Oh, is it already an IR thing? Cause look, the second I put it down, it knows where it is. If I move the switch here, it's turning to it. Low battery. On the Joy-Con, it says? Uh. See, look at that. So cool. <laughs> Sounds like an ice cream truck. Oh, that's neat. Look, it can, it can follow my hand. I think it's the surface, too, is the problem, but... I think I what know. would be best is probably like a hardwood floor for something like this. Yeah, probably something like that. Hardwood floor. Maybe right. tile. So... Maybe not. Let's see how we can do... Two player. There we go. So we need to connect another pair of Joy Cons to yours. Ow. Good job. Uh, okay. Uh. Ow. Oh, that's. Wait, which color connected? Blue? Alright, so let me bring the other blue. How'd you do that? Alright. Um, okay, I need to connect this one to the switch to. Now it's paired. So how do you... Oh, why there's two blue ones connected? No, I don't want to connect. Well, oh, all right. Oh, this one's also connected, apparently. Um. Yeah. I know. Yeah. It's yeah that way. And this one is oh, connected. Okay. Okay. Um. <coughs> <coughs> All right, so let me move the antenna thing off actually. So, <coughs> let's put our RC cars down on here, and put it away. Okay. And so, basically, uh, let me see if I can flip it and show you. So yours are the blue ones, mm -hmm. and mine are these ones, so you can... And you can have them like ram each other and like... <laughs> I guess there's no way to go in reverse, really, is there? Oh, it's some competition. Okay, so here's the software. 
All right, so let's try and... Oh, so you can make it go slower or faster. <laughs> That's interesting. basically race exactly and you can um, decorate them you can do cool interesting things with the IR sensor as well which is really neat all right let's see what else is on here so if I go back um, all right so IR sensor what's that mean? oh that's just uh, okay oops all right so we'll have to learn all the different pieces in the software of what you can do but um, Oh, can you just that, imagine that, that just going off in the middle <laughs> just of the ima night? Yeah, imagine this. <laughs> I think that would be scary then when and it looks so randomly went off. Imagine if these things could go on carpet and stuff because the IR sensor would pick us up yeah. so it would turn on and then it would follow you at night. It's Nintendo's plan. All the, all the RC cars are going to come to life and plant bugs in our head. Cause like, look, you can you can kind of see us I kind of wonder, in the IR camera. Look at that. I kind of wonder what made them think of That's that so music. Cool. Why is it that music? That doesn't really seem like. There's the IR. Yeah. You would have that music for. Um, that is so crazy. For um, what do you call it? A. Hmm. All right. So now that we've done the RC car, there's a couple other things that have popped up. Um, but basically, yeah, so for different ways to build. What's a yellow? Oh, make, play, and discover. Got it. Cool. Is there a thing that tells you how to, get, like, you know, get, you know, how you're going to use these things? A Maybe it's pieces? this discover one? Let's click on discover because it says new. Oh, okay. There's a Professor Jerry. He looks kind of... He's been keeping an eye on oh, you. That's okay. not creepy at all. Been making toy cons, haven't you? Okay. Are you spying on me? I'm gonna say that. You'll never take me alive. Calm down, Hassan. We have business to discuss. Uh, so basically, there's like a little chat box that's like going here. Uh, it's in Discover. Thank you, Alex. Um, okay. Uh, he has a request. Uh, I'm actually really busy. So. Hear me out. All right. I sense potential. You can be an amazing inventor. So, Toy Con Development Lab. All right, cool, I'm in, let's do it. Excellent. You're officially the fourth member of the ToyCon development team. Who are the other three members? Oh, okay, he's gonna introduce us. So, Lerna. Lerna. Uh, Learn a lot. Learn a lot, <laughs> <Wow>. Get it? <laughs> um, she's the programmer, okay. Blah, 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 blah. And you wanna meet Plays. Plays, ha huh? Is that gonna be Tamichu or something? Plays. plays all the time. Plays all the time. Uh, this is your kind of thing, these puns. Yeah, but they're not coming from me, so I don't like <laughs> it. Uh, all right, her job is playing with stuff. Okay. Uh, there's one more. Oh, no. Professor Jerry. Jerry Riggs. <laughs> Jerry Riggs. Huh. Uh, all right. PhD in fabrication tech is what he has. All right, so we've met the whole team. So here's the whole team. Here's what it looks like. So fun little characters. It's kind of cool. All right, blah blah blah. Learn about the toy cons that we have, of course. Let's get right to it. All right, so they're showing a little video of different toy con stuff and a creepy hand in the IR sensor. How to play with them? Blah 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 blah. Mm. All right. Thanks, Sophie. Thank you. You're awesome. Even how to repair and decorate them. Ooh, so they're showing a little video of putting like stickers and stuff on it. And rubber bands and paint. Yeah. Oh, that's fancy. So this is pretty basic. I feel like with this thing, you mostly paid for like the stickers. 
But you can get really creative, like buy like nicer. I mean, this is a pretty cute tape, but you can probably find nicer stuff. In so that. in Japan, mostly... they actually have more kinds of tape, uh, like Mario themed and different ones. Like uh, they have a bunch of different kinds. But I feel but like you might be expensive. able to find, yeah, find like washi tape. This is basically washi tape. So you might you be able to find like the Nintendo brand ones here. And even if they release them, it's going to be expensive. So, you know, you can go to any craft store, buy your own stuff. You know, it, it, it even tells you, it's like, hey, you can decorate it in your own way. It's not like... They're not like on the box. It's like buy more, want to, want to decorate more. Buy more Nintendo themed stuff. It's like buy your own, get your own stuff decorated however you right. want. So, which I appreciate. How do I continue from here? How Is there a way to make that me? RC car as big as a house? Uh, maybe if you add your own pieces to it, but yeah, I don't think you're gonna be able to make this too much bigger because you also have to understand it has to be a right size mm -hmm. for the vibration thing to work. Okay, RC car P6. All right, straight. Oh, well, obstacle course. Maybe. Yeah, that's cool. So they've created an obstacle course. Oh. I mean, an obstacle course. That's very good, kid. I like the way you think. Still weirds me out how I can move around when it's just made of cardboard. Okay, so the vibrations make it move. I think in future live streams, by the way, guys, I think I am going to try having, like, live streaming from the Switch being docked so that you guys can mm -hmm. actually see what's going on. Although the only challenge with that comes in when it comes time to do, like, the piano or certain things like that. I can't dock the switch yeah. in there and do it you know there's a few more projects in here and i know Hassan's gonna do those and then he's also got the robot now i'm curious about how long the robot's gonna take supposedly i've heard like four hours three and a half four hours is what i've heard it's pretty crazy all right blah 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 so basically this is kind of like a little tutorial thing you can do the piano docked so that one you can do dock true um So this is kind of just going through a tutorial, guys. Most so, yeah. If you have any questions or anything, you can type in. What's gonna be my people's biggest issues? It's probably finding a place to store all of these, cause it's like you don't really want to unfold all this once you're done building it. And a lot of these pieces probably will take up quite will take up quite some bit of space. So you know, if you think this is gonna be something you want to do and make a hobby out of might want to clear a space so you have places to keep everything and make sure it's like a lot. Customizing your RC Ooh, car. Okay. All right, Let's so, see. so we got to the customization one now. Let's see. All right, here's the pieces. All right, so. Yeah, that's a standard RC car. Blah, blah, blah. Oh. oh, so somebody added tiger stripes, all right. Mm -hmm. So I might get paint and stuff to do all that. Oh, googly eyes. Okay, so they added a little googly eyes on one. Oh, you can't really even. There you go. Oh, uh, you got the stickers, the Google. What know. other little things do they? Oh, okay, so little antennas and stuff is what they have. Here. Okay, blah blah blah. You see the eyeglasses part on sheet A. Sheet A. So that is the sheet. Right? Looks like this. Oh, those are the eyeglasses. Okay. Yeah. So we'll pop out the eyeglasses. Oh no, it's this. Uh, which one? Wait. Wait. Is it on a different sheet or is it? No, it's on sheet A. Well, these are all sheet A. Is it on this one, maybe? The bonus one? I think it oh, is. Oh, yeah, it's on the roof. Roof part. Okay. It is. This isn't it. It's the one with the roof on it. What the roof? Okay, I don't see any roof yet. Um... Run it here? A with the roof. That's not the roof. The one with the sh um the shingle roof. It's one of the black ones, right? No. Oh, no, it's over it here. <laughs> I, was like, I had it the whole time. There so here's it is. Here's the glasses. Yeah. Okay. So. Oh, I see. So it just folds in to the front here. Let's see. Right. So we're just customizing our RC cars now. 
I guess I'll just slide them to the front. Yeah, I can just stick it in there, I guess. Here? Yes. Yep. Oh, and this slides right nice. in. Nice. That's cute. So little eyes. And you can stick little eyes on it. Sheet A also contains three more custom parts. You can use them for even more upgrades. So we have the elephant. And this is the elephant right here. And then they have two other little pieces as well. So what are those other pieces? Oh, no, it's on, yeah, that sheet. Yeah. yeah. And then that thing. Okay. First custom part is the elephant. Okay. Okay. I can oh, take the okay. eyes if you want to use the elephant. And then you just stick the elephant in like you did with the eyes. Right in. That's cute. That's right in. There you go. Oh. <laughs> Look at that. Oh. Right in. That was an elephant. Second is the that was an elephant. <laughs> oh, where's the other piece? Oh, shit. Why are they like doing this and not giving us time to. What is going on? Wait, go back. It, it's just playing all the way through. Okay. What is that? It's supposed to be a truck, apparently. Okay, so I'm going to play the video. Okay. Oh, this is attaches on the side like that. I think you yeah, sideways into that. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Okay, well, let's take it. If you want, if you want to keep the elephant, you don't have to. I can put the truck on mine, or you can. Yeah, keep you the elephant. can. That way, you because I like the elephant one, so that's cute. You can keep that one. Oh, excuse me. Right, so it's supposed to be a little truck or something, so it's got like that on it. I'm gonna leave the little eyes on here too. <laughs> um, okay. Last but not least is the digger. Oh, okay. That's this. Oh, so that probably goes with the truck or something maybe? I don't know. Oh, interesting, okay. Oh. So that's kind of cool. So yeah, so it's like a little, like a plow, sort of, like. That's neat. Okay. Okay. So here's a little piece, and then this one will attach into the front. Just like that. That's kind of cool. You know what would be crazy? I don't think it's possible. It would be crazy if you could actually lift it up. I don't see there's how there's any way to do that, but that would be pretty crazy. You put the glasses crazy. on your elephant. <laughs> Let's see. Let me see these stickers, I think. Oh, that's kind of cute. Oh, how they like decorated so stuff. Um, oh, that's cool. All the different ways they decorated things, yeah, like the little so truck. I think I'm going to stick some eyes Color on tape. these glasses. I think I'm going to do these little... I think that would be cute. Now, this is one of those things where I think if you have those little tweezers and stuff to place. <laughs> so let's see. Yeah, let's try and customize stuff. Well, you know what? I'll leave this one as is, and we'll, we'll you can customize that one with whatever you want. Okay. That way, if anybody wants to see what the like the original one looks like, they have that. <laughs> That's cute. Um, so you can. So if you want to use any other, so we have all the other stickers and things as well. I think um, I want to get creative and paint this and stuff. Okay. Um, but I will definitely want to. So in a, in a um, do you want to put these I'm stickers on afterwards it. then after you I paint it so that yeah. it doesn't? Yeah, um, but I'm definitely, I think I'm going to want to use 
this and write my name on it so we know whose car is whose. Yeah, so what we'll do then is in a future video, I'll show you her creation. So if you want to mm -hmm. see what, what she was able to turn I'm it into. I'm really into it. I, need, I think I need to buy some paint and stuff now. <laughs> these are pretty cool. Yeah, and then once I build all these like Labo things, we'll be able to decorate them and stuff. Mm -hmm. But this, So there's all sorts of different modes. There's a self-driving mm -hmm. mode um, because there's ways to um, have little targets and stuff. So lots of interesting stuff that you can do with it. I'm not going to show all of it on here, but it's pretty complex. There seems to be a lot yeah. that you can do here. Um, so that's really interesting. So um, the last thing that I want to do is I just want to ask to anybody left in the chat, uh, if anybody's still there. Leon VPs, you guys, mm -hmm. the ones who stuck around. Yeah, you guys get to decide, what do you want me to do next? Not in this video. I, I will say this. I want to do the piano last because that's the biggest one in the variety kit. So do you want me to do the fishing rod, the house, or the motorbike? Fishing rod, house, or motorbike? You guys tell me right now what is going to be the next live stream for Nintendo Lab. Oh. If anybody's left. Otherwise, I'm just going to I'm going to solve the view. <laughs> now is your chance. Motorbike, motorbike because I'm curious. All right, Tomas has decided. Yep, you are the first decided. person to say Thank it. You. Motorbike, motorbike is next, Tomas. So I think when probably Sunday I think Sunday I'll probably do the okay. next one Going. Okay. Um, so Sunday I don't know when but Sunday I'm gonna do the motorbike next um, 